All right, here we are, Down East Yachting in Jupiter. I'm Jennifer, that's Eric. We are gonna take a tour of the interior of the Sabre 58 Salon Express, brand new model for us. Eric's starting in our aft galley. So, we're just well taking you through the interior today. That aft galley, as you can see, is between the cockpit and the salon. It's up, which is very different than, than most layouts, but it really works. We're connecting people, space is very social, laid out very well. If you like cooking or preparing food, you know, you're not tucked away down below. You're part of the part of the party. It looks like some bar chairs might fit there. Uh, yep, we could you could put some there. We can also put in a in a big um, Maybe a grill? A grill, that's not the word I was looking for. And then we just change the layout of this door. Very simple ah, to do. Well, okay. Let's go forward. So then from the galley to the salon, we take one step up. So we've got wonderful seating, U-shape on the port side, big straight settee on the starboard side. One thing that caught my eye immediately was how much natural light is in this in this in the uh, salon here. Big, big windows really highlights the craftsmanship and the beautiful cherry wood of the boat. So enjoy that. Now coming forward, we get to the helm area. I could go on for hours, but I know we're going to keep, keep making this short. Him cut. <laughs> so um, two stint seats with uh, the IPS joystick control. We've got this is IPS, twin IPS 950s, which are the 725 horsepower motors two 23-inch Garmin displays here. They're really the control of the boat. I mean, it does everything from AC to DC to navigation, all controlled through there. We've got the C-Zone digital switching. Another big element in addition to the, all the light was the goal was to get so two couples could sit facing forward very comfortably and cruise, cruise together, both on the same plane. All right, let's go below. All right, so we take a couple steps. And we'll go up into the VIP. So the amount of space they got into this 58 foot boat is impressive. This isn't the master? It, that's what a lot of people thought, but it's not. This is the, this is the VIP, really nice space here, an attached head with a separate shower. And what do we have over here? And then we've got the, the third cabin over here with two singles that come together electrically uh, with a push of a button. That can't be a head in there, is it? It is. Oh, it's, it's the second. Se second, or the, the, it turns out to be the third head and separate shower. Okay. So now we can see the master, which is a masterpiece. <laughs> he did not practice that. <laughs> All right, what is that? I can't even get it in so, the picture. That's right. So the the master is a full beam master with um, huge king size berth. Um, regular, no chopping off the ends or squeezing things in. Plenty of space. Great storage aft. Here we've got our um, master head and shower. And then I've heard you have a secret. This is so. This boat has got its own electronics locker, much like a pump room, but this is for all the electronics to be in one place. Make a lot of lot of service people happy. Yeah, we could also make a big mess in here. <laughs> all we're right. Not, we're not allowed in is here. that the washer? No, that's just a little study desk. Yeah. That's Vanity. nice. Yes. Now, a lot of people ask where the washer and dryer is. And here we go, washer and dryer. Are those full size? They are. Side by size. Yep, all vented wow. overboard. I'd even do the wash on this boat. Oh, wait, say that again? I probably would do the wash <laughs> on this boat. <laughs> all right, so. well that about wraps up our interior tour and we ended on a high note with Eric doing the wash, yeah. so that's good. All right, thanks.